I am here today to finally answer the question on how hermaphrodites determine who will play the role of a male and the female one mating. But first, let's cover what a hermaphrodite is. A hermaphrodite is any organism that has both a male and female sexual organs at the same time. It is important for hermaphrodites to mate with others to maintain variation within a population. When mating, however, being the female requires much more energy because they are tasked with the responsibility to develop the eggs. Depending on the organism, the method for determining which role they will play may differ. One example is in flatworms. The sex is determined through a fighting process. The fight involves two individuals fighting with a side-by-side -side penises, using them as a weapon. They will try to ejaculate on the other's body, and then the sperm will dissolve the flesh and reach the eggs to fertilize them. It is possible for both to achieve this, however, it is rare. Another example of this decision making is in Hamlet fish, one of few hermaphrodite vertebrates. Hamlet fish take a less aggressive approach by taking turns being the female and laying the eggs or being the male and fertilizing the eggs with sperm. The process of determining what individuals will act as the male and which will act as the female and simultaneous hermaphrodites is variable through organisms. However, they all have a similar goal to maintain variation in their population.